Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Trailer Explanations. In this video, we are going to cover unit manage chatter from the project customize and all to support a new business. So here we are going to basically cover the concept of how we can create a charter group and manage its members or add members to this particular charter group. And we will also see how we can create a post or a poll in a particular charter group. So let's, without wasting any time, quickly launch our trailer playground, which I've already done here. And you will land on this starter app page. Go to uh, app launcher and search for accounts. Here we have to create an account. Uh, so you will find, uh, so this is a recently viewed list open. Click on all accounts and you will find edge communication uh, account over here. So you have to select this and open the record detail page over here uh, for this account. Now, first of all, click on this follow button. So this button allows you to track all the activities that will happen in this account. So basically it tracks, if it, this is uh, for, used for feed tracking. Now we have to create a related case for this account. So if you scroll down, you will uh, see a related list for cases. Click on new button. You have to create a new case. Uh, the details have been provided here in the challenge itself or the unit itself. So I'm going to uh, take the same. So case origin is email type is electronic case reason is performance. So going back here uh, to the detail page, I have to case origin is email. Then type is electronic and case reason is performance. Then we have to provide the subject. If you scroll down to the bottom, you will find a description information uh, section. There you have to paste the subject, uh, which I will copy here from the table itself and pasting it in the subject text area. Then next is we have to copy the description and just below the subject, the description field is there. So paste it in the text area. Click on save. So this will create a related case to this edge communication account. Now, next we have to create a charter group. So go to app launcher again and search for groups as we have to create a new one. So I will be copying this uh, group name from here and going back again in uh, open your app launcher and search for group. It will filter out a result uh, groups for you. So click on that and we have to create a new one. So click on new button. Now for the name, I will be pasting the name which I've copied from the unit and description. I will be copying again uh, from this table itself, the detail table for group uh, and paste this description here in the description text area. Now access type has to be private, allow customer has to be selected. You scroll down to bottom, access type, drop, click on access type drop down and select private. Allow customers a checkbox need to be checked. Click on save and next. Click on next again. And here we have to add these two users which we created in our uh, last unit. So click on add for both these users. Now, next we have to uh, click on done and where it says share and update we have to type this message. We have to post this message. So I will be copying this message over here. But before that, once I click uh, on this done button, this will create a group for us. So this is a private group. So what I'll do is, uh, so any member who has been added to this particular group can only see the uh, activities posted in this as it is private to the customers. Now we have to share an update. So post this message to a group. So what I'll do is I will go to this post tab, as you can see, and I have to share an update over here. So click on the share and update uh, section. And here I will be pasting the uh, text that I've copied from the uh, unit. Click on share button and you can also like or comment. So this is basically like we have our social, uh, social media app, uh, like Facebook, Instagram, and WhatsApp. So it, this is the same way for the internal users of uh, Salesforce or any business in particular. So click on uh, share button. Now, next we have uh, to navigate to groups and click on edge communication support. Now uh, to get members participation rolling into this new group, we have, what we have to do is we have to create a post in the form of poll. 
basically it is a poll uh, poll action that we have to select so what i'll do is i'll go back again we have created this uh, post now it's time for us to create a poll so just beside post you will find this poll tab click on this poll tab and here i have to type the question that is present in this table so copying this question i will go back here and in the question text area i will paste this then uh, there are two choices that has to be placed, yes or no. So I will go back again and in choice one text area, I will type yes and choice two will be no. So as you can see, this is a simple, the social media app that we all have. So this is the internal uh, charting area for the business people. So click on ask button. You can also add new uh, choices uh, by clicking on the button that was coming on left hand side. But as for our challenge, uh, this was it that we have to provide only the two choices. Now, next we are good to go to check our challenge. As you can see, we posted this uh, post over here and we have also created a poll. Now let's go back and check our ch challenge. Click on verify step to earn 100 points. Let's just wait for it to give out the results. Hopefully we should be able to pass this unit. There you go, this unit has been completed. See you in the next video with another unit. Till then, take care.